In this episode, we will learn how to automatically exhalate tickets from one system to the other. In the previous video, we did a manual exhalation process where a user had to click on a button in the UI and send the ticket over to the other side. In order to automate this process, Exhalate provides you with triggers, and we need to configure those triggers. To get started, let's click on the Edit Connection button here, and on the screen, go to the Triggers tab. The Triggers screen is where Exhalate adds automation. As we have no trigger right now, we should create one to get started. So a trigger is created by writing a search query, which acts as a filter and informs Exhalate which issues should be automatically exhalated using this connection. In order to write that search query, you need to follow the search query language syntax of the underlying task management system. I'm using Jira Cloud here, so I should write this using simple JQL. Any valid JQL query can act as a filter out here. I will start with a statement saying that project equals CM and my summary field is like, let's say training. What it means is that any tickets that is within project CM and has the word training in the summary should automatically be picked up by this connection and sent over to the Azure DevOps side. I'll toggle the active button on and click add. Now Exalate will look for create and update events that match this search criterion, whatever that happens to be. And any issues that match this criterion will automatically be sent over to the other side. All right, to test it out, let's create an issue within Project CM. And in the summary, I will include the word training, so that is automatically sent over. Let's click on Create. Now the actual creation should be enough for Exalate to realize whether it meets the filter criteria within the trigger. And that's enough for Exalate to start sending it over to the other side. In order to monitor that, you can go to the Exalate panel. And yeah, by the time I get there, it's already created the twin issue on the Azure DevOps side. And the synchronization is complete. And that is how you automate exhalation process by using triggers within Exhalate. 